So my name is Gary Clark and I am the Artistic Director of Gary Clark Company, which is a mid-scale touring professional dance company based in Barnsley. I'm originally from the coal mining village of Grimethorpe, so I'm born and bred uh, in the town. Um, and I'm currently working on this photography exhibition um, with the Has Project, which is very much focusing on Elgin Street and its buildings and architecture and heritage, and linking it to Gary Clark Company's most recent production, Wasteland. So Wasteland is a mid-scale touring production which looks at the downfall of industrial Britain, so when all the coal mines closed in Barnsley and all the villages surrounding Barnsley and South Yorkshire, and the rise of the UK rave culture, both political movements, uh, the production brings together professional dancers, a community cast of male singers, um, archive film footage, live brass musicians to tell the story um, of what happened 30 years ago. And as part of the retelling of these stories in the show Visiting Bowser Civic, we've been putting together a series of um, activities to animate Bowser Town Centre in various different ways, which we're calling the Wasteland Town Trails. Um, where different elements of the production will animate different spaces in and around Barnsley. So we're working with Carter Mayor Pritty Collier Band, who's going to play some minor classics. We've got our community cast of male singers who are going to parade through the town singing some well-loved minor hymns. And also we've got our ravers taking over the whole of the town centre to create some amazing energy within the town to finish them for the style of this school. And this photography exhibition is to help him support all of that activity as well as the touring production which will be coming to Banana Civic on the 21st and 22nd of April. So we've been working really closely with the Has Project, which is really about kind of invigorating and bringing to life the High Street and specifically Elgin Street in Barnsley. And um, we, we were working with various bits of architecture to try and bring movement to these spaces to kind of give a different um, perception on the, on the building of what we might be used to. Um, I think we really worked visually to try and make the architecture pop. I was working really closely with movement to try and get the dancers in the company to really respond to the space that they, that they were in. Some of these spaces on Elgin Street are beautiful and historic and, and big and bold. So it was about trying to create frames and images and movement that kind of um, almost filled that space and brought it to life through action. So rather than just doing kind of still photographic images, it was about trying to catch a movement within them and use the buildings as a kind of backdrop and framework to frame the action. And also addressing the dancers in the in the wasteland costumes, which are really vibrant and colourful. It really pops through. So I think the collaboration between the architecture and dance and movement was a great one and I think you can clearly see in some of the images. I think we've got something really unique and really vibrant and exciting. Um, that we can use in various different ways. So yeah, I think it's been a great collaboration and it's been brilliant to work with you know, the archive and the history of Elvis Street and learn more about those spaces to then animate. Um, yeah, we've really enjoyed it.
from Barnsley. I've been living here all my life, so 43 years, and I've always been in and out of the town. But I think for the first time, I've been working with the Has Project, it's really allowed me to look at the architecture and the buildings in much more detail and learn about the, the history and the, the historical history behind Elton Street and its buildings and its people and its businesses. So yeah, suddenly I'm, I'm, I'm looking up and seeing new things in the building. I'm looking out through the eyes of an artist rather than just someone that lives here. So it's really deepened my understanding of Barbie's history. And I'm really surprised. It's really unearthed some fantastic new information for me, which I'm really excited about and proud of coming from Barnsley. Um, and I'm excited to see where we can go with this in the future as a, as a company based here, is to work with Barnsley's architecture and history and heritage and to bring it to life in, in various ways. So yeah, it's really opened my eyes to some exciting stuff.